yeah. on the table. In my space. Uh, well, Eric, if you get, if you get, <laughs> if you get like, a little table, you put it on that. But if you get a little table, where, where would you put a little? Table? Right behind him. Right behind him. Yep. How would he get out? Like, How, what are you him. doing? Yeah, so you're just table. you're just inviting chaos, Eric. Right there. That's what you're doing. You, you want a table of Look just that. shit sitting behind us? Look at it. That's what you want. Perfect. Perfect. Look, Perfect. You can't even see it. It's yeah. awesome. Calvin, good because it's off your table. Holy shit. It's that easy, folks. Look, his arm perfectly covered it. I I don't know, I don't know what you're trying to prove yeah. there. Why are you just like it? moving shit back there, like acting like you're moving things? You're not moving anything. Ah! That's why my pen broke. He uses it as a can opener. I would never entertain that thought. I almost had a precedent. People start using my stuff just to. <laughs> I'm what dick. stuff would we use? Your your highlighter? A table. That's your table too. So you got two tables now? Yeah, Man. Is that what it is? That, that was is such bait. Chum, chum, chum under the water. <laughs> chum. <laughs> I'm just saying, he already, he already <laughs> showed there, there. How many tables do you need? I thought that was Rick and the Cowboys yeah. table. Now it's Eric's table too. Be very careful. I'm going to claim this one's mine too. Okay. Yeah. Get your stuff off. No, we need this. I just throw the table. We're doing no tables now. No tables. Everyone writes on their legs. Aaron, get your shit off Eric's table. Hey guys, community. <laughs> 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 hey guys, crew of Blonde Wave back. I'm Calvin. Aaron! And we're back with community. Mm -hmm. Last time a community. Last chicken time power. Community. Chicken and brothers. Mafia chicken fingers. Annie's boobs. Banana. Yep. Those are my notes. Uh, I stand oh. by them. Psychopharmacology is not crazy farm animals. Unfortunately. I prefer my notes. But Abed was connecting with people. Yeah. Which is interesting. What's next? We'll you decide. Out. We're watching what? the next episode oh, right now. We'll find out it's now. been years since they made this. I go to a shelter and rescue an animal that genuinely needs my help. Okay? Why do you think I am knitting a tiny little eye patch? Hmm. Excuse me. That's adorable. <laughs> Can you tell us exactly what you did in your lives to end up here so that we don't make the same mistakes? Schmitty. <laughs> 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 Schmitty! Are you, gonna, are you gonna knit me something sad in your house? Why Schmitty? No Tell me this episode ends with these children getting their ass beat. Why Schmitty? I don't that one kid's wearing a tie, Calvin. Tell you what Whoa, it. what's... You realize the things that could be done now. What's Pierce doing? Yanked, choked, hung. Yeah. yeah. You just look good. No. <laughs> he looks like a piece of shit in a tie. Tell me exactly. Jeff, it get under your skin. Excuse me! <laughs> and we'll visit the man in the moon. <laughs> Whoa. Sorry. Sorry. Smashing oh. the guitar of someone singing a flowing love song was on my quintessential college experience list. <laughs> Make out with the hottest girl on campus. Check a Rooney. Unfortunately, the school year is almost over and there's a bunch of stuff left on the list. I'll help you finish it. I'll be like your Morgan. Well, Bruce. who was it? Well, if it wasn't her and it wasn't her, then who was it? I think they're just realizing they're not the hottest girl. On I campus. know. I want to who it was. <gasps> It would have been better if you were wearing the standard giant hearts on underwear, but I'll take it. Oh, yeah? Well, I hope getting pants is on your list. It is. <laughs> it has the hearts. It is. What's a funny? <laughs> no! Help! Help! Aaron, that's your laugh. Get it? Get it? What was she wearing? What happened? Or is it just the fact of what it, what he did? Inappropriate. I saw a mistake happening as soon as it was happening. You're gonna have to apologize later. Apologize? Apologize? No. She, she should apologize to me. She ruined my joke. <sighs> nope. Going back in. I bet. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> There's a grandpa slip slap. <laughs> I am your slip slap. I don't get it either. And now you hang out with Slip Slap and Slap Skank. Oh my god. I don't get the names. Discmans are retro. Oh, oh, it's retro when you're 30 and broke. It's uncompressed music. It's uncompressed! It sounds so much better. It does. You and your special headphones. I can just hear better. And see better. <laughs> I'm just better, Aaron. You're just better. <laughs> but you can't talk better. <laughs> 
Hey, it's, it's like a blind man being able to smell better. <laughs> you will never change. <laughs> that is the pot calling the kettle. Uh, kettle. Okay. Oh, you can say black, Pierce. I'm a black woman. You have literally identified me to strangers as the black woman. Out of context. <laughs> what? I call the other women flat butt and the one Avid wants a nail. Which one? So what's the hey! For no. Spread it. He still assumes I'm a terrorist. If you're not, I'm sorry. But if you are, I'm a hero. And I'm willing to take that chance. You said I have a crafty Jew brain. Nobody knows how to take a compliment anymore. Look, either Crap. he leaves the group or I do. What? Huh? Pierces. Ow! Gave him all the pieces. Oh my god. <laughs> yes, I'll Oh man. Why are they just holding piles of shit? Crap. Did he steal from the Girl Scouts? Have you seen a Chinese kid? Kid. Kid. Why are they on campus? <laughs> They're so selling Girl Scouts. Where was he? We don't stop till he's crying. Oh, check out Frank and Mom. Ooh, we can. Yes, they are gonna beat his ass. We can make fun of him for coming from a broken home. Oh, uh, is that? <sighs> I don't care if this gets dirty. Me. He asked for it. All right. What? Right. He offered no respect. He will get no respect, Calvin. Those are the rules. After she's done shooting the real housewives of Greendale County. After she's done shooting the real housewives of Greendale County. And That's not a good That's response. A your parents are divorced. Oh, your, your parents, parents are, are divorced. divorced. Yeah. 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 Come on. They're really good at that. These kids are so well casted. Yeah, they are. <laughs> I want to murder them. What great actors they are. <laughs> what is that? Uh, it's a weird dog. They got their goat. What? They got their goat. That's why it's a weird dog. It's like he's sitting down. Ask the goat to explain it to you. <laughs> Pierce's universally recognized social flaws made him the scapegoat. A lightning rod. They got a scapegoat. My uncle was struck by lightning. You think it give you superpowers, but now it just masturbates in theaters. It's very interesting. Now? What? After Pierce, you're the most bigoted. What? Ooh. Ooh, what about Abed? Abed's weird. No. No. Abed's weird. Guys, he's all right. We like him. Yeah, Pierce comes. Do the double Pierce, me. Yeah, the triple Pierce. So much. Still double dog daring. <laughs> They're making us walk around with pretzels in our butts. I put mustard on mine like an idiot. Pierce. What does that feel like? Okay. Oh, my. Surely, I know you don't want to hear what I have to say. But Seriously. Oh. Oh, sure. <laughs> wow. You know what? Screw you. I don't even owe you an apology. They wrote this. Run! Just pretend like you sleep. Just pretend like you sleep. <laughs> he's, he's done that before. Yeah. I'm out of the group. What? Shirley! Oh, damn, oh, Shirley, man. don't Shirley, go please. Uh-oh. Sassy Black Schmidt, he's out of the group. Oh, no, not the group. Who is that? Punk ass who needs to be destroyed. Yes! Bang his mom! Shirley thinks we don't care about her. Too no, much. No. Oh, sorry. Wow. Too much, Sharon. Reel it back. Yeah. You need to bang that kid's mom. Ah! <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> Doesn't it feel good? Oh my god. I thought I was around. <laughs> I know. If she's divorced, go for bikini wax. Put pieces go together, okay? The arms. He's got the arms out. I try to keep things where they should be. I think I might be where I should be. <laughs> Look at Britta back there. Boobatron's great. Boobatron? Uh -huh. You're my friend, right? What is Friends are supposed to help each other no matter what. Ridiculous situation, descending into have a handed drama for the illusion of story. Ch -ch -ch -ch. Check. <laughs> All right, I am back in. <laughs> <laughs> what? What is the point That's of this? That's all it took. What are we doing? Think of me as some sort of mom. They both need to learn some manners, and you know what? Annie needs to stop dating Vaughn. He's cute, but he's not the kind of boy I envisioned her ending up with. No matter how hard you're acting like a mom. That's why you think pants and me wasn't wrong. Was. Was. I mean, I guess in a weird, crazy way, he didn't treat her differently than anyone else. <laughs> but what are you doing? <laughs> I just read that. Oh, 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 oh. 
All that progress. <laughs> there was so much. Looks like you'll be calling somebody daddy soon, or at least your mom will be. <laughs> He's biting her <laughs> in public. Oh my God, you are pathetic. Oh, yes. What are you looking at? What are you looking at? <laughs> what are you looking at? A duh. Duh. Oh, school is ass, Mark. <laughs> Got scratched his head. It's funny. <laughs> what the hell? What is its function? Why are Jeff and Britta making fun of those handicapped kids? They don't even realize how much they need. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Jeff and Britta have the two most fragile egos of the group. Losing to these kids will pretty much destroy them. You gotta join in. Ah, oh, do you gonna mom them? Pantsed! Now push them. You didn't say go! Oh, we win! No. You're the Schmitties! No, no, no. You have already embarrassed me by getting pwned. Don't be so Yeah. Yes. What is going on? Classic college experiences never happen organically. Oh! Food fight! Where's the party in the answer is me? What? Are you sure it's the name of my grade school and my favorite soft drink? George Washington Lemon Fresca. That's a horrible porn name. I don't make the rules. Someone here order a pizza? The base. You guys? That's my pizza, but you took longer than 30 minutes, so I'm not paying. <laughs> what were the rules for the porn name? Uh, elementary school. It was your high school, I think. High school. Right? Or was it elementary school? I thought it was. Go back. I need to find it out so we can. It was your school names. and your favorite soft drink or something like that. Are you sure it's the name of my grade school and my favorite soft drink? Grade school. Okay. Yeah. Which one's my grade school? Like middle school, yeah. I think. No, grade school was like your elementary school. Was grade school my elementary school? Yeah. But I went K through 3 as my main school, and then 4 through 8 as my school. So yeah. which one? I don't know. I did 1 through 6 in my grade school. Probably 4 through 8, I would say. Huh. I don't know. Let's look up the definition of grade school so we can figure out each other's porn names. Let's look up the definition of elementary school. Why? Well, well, I wonder the difference. But grade school is the... Grade school and elementary school. Mm -hmm. Grade school is an elementary school? It says grade school. An elementary school is the definition. Elementary school, a school for the first four to six grades and usually including kindergarten. Yeah. Well, then I, I don't know. So, an elementary school. I had a K through three and I had a four through eight. Mm -hmm. But four through eight covers four and six, but yeah. then I also cover seven and eight. But seven and eight doesn't classify as an elementary school. I would say it's the first one. And okay. the other one was K through would... three, but I only went there for third grade. Then the one that you attended for more years. So the second one. That would have been the 4 through 6. Yeah. Or 4 through 8. The 4 through 8 school that you attended 4 through 6 so for the purpose of kindergarten this. Kindergarten to second, and the second I moved around, and I caught a quarter of second grade at the one, and then all of third grade, and then 4 through 8th grade, and then high school. Well, just pick the one that sounds the best in a poor name. Yeah. Jesus. Mm -hmm. I don't know about you. Home. <laughs> Home Coke. <laughs> no, I hate Coke. <laughs> what's your... What's your Favorite um, refreshment. Is it refreshment or it's soft a soda, right? Your favorite oh, well, soft, soft drink. drink. Yeah. Your favorite soft drink, yeah. It's, it's right there. Which is a soda, right? Like a pop. Like a Coke. Sometimes, Aaron. It's not like orange juice, right? It's fucking sometimes. Well, you, what, you, you obviously don't know the answer. You like, I well, no, because I know you won't accept my answer, even though I'm dead right. Well, what, like, why are you going to look it up first? You didn't say what it was. We need that right. Cutting out the middle man. I'm saying it's a soda, right? Soda, cutting, soft drink, pop, coke. He's cutting the argument out. All the discussions that people say, how do you say it? Give me a Pepsi. What kind? It's a non-alcoholic drink, especially one that is carbonated. So it could be orange juice well, or milk or it yeah. doesn't have to it, be Normally it is a especially it is a non-water beverage. Like he said something about lemonade. Right? That's what I was wondering, like what a soft Drink. Well, there's lemon fresco or whatever. Like, like yeah. that sounds like a soda of some sort. With Favorite lemon. like well, carbonated. Yeah, fresca is like soda water with yeah, a little bit of flavor. The deep, it's, right? It, yeah, the deep. The deep. So the what's your shit. what's your school? I guess Bartlett. So you could be like Bartlett Monster. That's your porn name. Bartlett White Monster. 
Was it just Bartlett Elementary? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I figured you cut out the elementary part, right? Yeah. Like, if you were, like, Warren High School, you would just cut out the high school and just be Warren, right? Sure. So I'd have Cutler, Bartlett, or Warren. Hmm. What's yours, Eric? Well, Salem Liberty is my elementary school. So I had so I have to use both of those, Salem and Liberty? Yeah. Because Liberty just sounds like it would be a fun name. Liberty. No, I think it's, yeah. Salem yeah. hyphen Salem, Liberty. Liberty, and then my favorite carbonated drink doesn't have to be carbonated. Soft drink. Well, it has to especially be carbonated. <laughs> Wait, well, it has to especially be? No, especially ones that are carbonated. It can be something that's not, but most So it's like something. all carbonated like drinks are soft drinks, but not all soft drinks are carbonated? Yeah. One of those kind of things? Um, I'd say mine's between White Monster or Dr. Pepper. Yeah. So Bartlett White Monster sounds better, I think, though, so I'll go with that one. I like a good diet Pepsi. Yeah? Yeah. Huh. So you want to be Salem Liberty Diet Pepsi? Yeah. I'm, uh, I don't think it's super exciting. I don't think it's a good formula for poor name myself. Waxler mm. Hill Brisk Ice Tea. That's not bad. Waxler Hill? Yeah. Is that the hill behind your own house? Yeah, it's the hill that we live on. Yeah. Yeah. We're like wisdom class. We're like, ah, go up the hill, kids. It's no. Like that it was like go down the hill. Oh, down! Oh, no. damn! Sure, okay, come back <laughs> up, man. So is that like Grub Elementary? No. What was the soda or soft drink? Brisk iced tea. Brisk iced tea. Brisk iced tea. Yeah. yeah. I don't think it's a good formula. I don't. Think I, I've heard other ones too, where it's like take the street you lived yeah. on and your mother's maiden name mm-hmm. or stuff like that. I don't know. Or like your in which order? Your first pet's name and. Yeah, there's some weird ones, especially ones that use your own name. They're like, well, take this and your surname, because mine are almost ultimately all like, White Dingo. And I'm like, I don't want to be White Dingo. Why not? (laughs) Because it sounds weird and racist. He's White Monster. I guess so. (laughs) Bartlett White White Monster. Bartlett Bartlett White White Monster. My my apologies, Mr. Monster. Mm. All right, well, it was a fun episode. Those kids were terrible. This is one of my It's infuriating. Cringe. It's it's yeah. I can't imagine Watchings someone ever. treating me that way. Like, I understand that that like they're coming at it from a meta point where like it's just, it doesn't matter what they're saying. It doesn't matter who they are. They are just duh, like just dumb kids, and they went down to this kid's level. I get that. Yeah. But like, I just can't help but try to imagine someone like treating me that way. It it's, made me it's a, difficult. Just it's difficult to imagine someone. Who is that? I get excited. Young trying, and dumb. I know, but like I get excited trying to figure out ways to make them regret their behavior. And I think it's a problem I got. Like I want them to rue the day. <laughs> I don't think that's a that problem. Never I think that's just something that adults have to do. <laughs> Maybe I guess. I wonder where like where that like it's like a primal feeling comes from. Is it like you know like when the silverback and then the young ape comes up and then you got to beat them down? But eventually they're gonna beat you down. It's gonna happen, you know. What? But I don't want it to be with, Duh. you know. Duh. I want, but like I want someone to like do something so impressive that destroys me. I like that, like a like they beat me in a rap battle or something. A rap battle. Oh yeah, I'd definitely lose. That's what I'm saying. It's devastating. Thanks to back in high school, you used to do this stuff all the time. You're really good at it. No. Oh, okay. No, I was talking about cake. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's a witty retort. The kids should have said something like that, not Schmitty. I didn't get oh the Schmitty thing. I don't understand. It's just... It's not... You're not meant to get it. Right? It's, like, the idea is that, like... It's these, like the new thing that yeah. is in one week and out the next. Yeah. That is super fucking annoying, that makes no sense, but somehow young kids cling to it and yeah. say it way too fucking much. Exactly. Like, the writers here are saying their D and Schmitty is X, and X is ah! what exactly... Yeah, yeah. Like, it's exactly what Calvin just said. <laughs> And because their ego is so fragile, they had to go down to that level. The food fight ending was more wholesome than I wanted. Have you guys yeah. ever been in a food fight? No. I don't think I've ever been Not in a food fight. Not intentionally. I see it happen on TVs and movies and stuff, but I don't think I've ever been in a food fight. I think it's banned now. Wait, what do you mean intentionally? Who was well, intentionally in a food fight? What are you talking about? Have you, like, or have you someone, not? Just answer the question, Gavin. I mean, that's kind of a food fight. Right that's there. not a food fight. Unless he picks it up and starts throwing food back at you, and then it's a food fight. God, if you actually <laughs> do that, I'd respect it. <laughs> I want it to so bad. bad. <laughs> I want it to so bad, but it totally would have ruined your notes. Yeah, it would have. 
and Plus, the tablecloth. Yours. <laughs> and your shirt. Yeah. <laughs> Unintentionally, someone has gotten mad and, like, spilled something on me, but not, like, thrown it. Like, they've turned around yeah. in a huff yeah. and, like, their drink has sloshed out. I don't mean right. someone threw food at you once or they accidentally threw food at you. I mean, were you in a food fight? There are multiple people with multiple foods. Don't look at the definition of a food fight. Oh, yeah, actually. Like, it was broken up really, fight. really quickly, but I have, yeah. At church camp. At church camp? Yeah. I feel like it I remember was, back It in- was one end of one table started throwing food back and forth at each other, and someone picked up a salt shaker, and a counselor ended it right there real quick. See, it's a playful fight in which people throw food at each other. I think there was one time back in Bartlett yeah. where kids were like White catapulting peas at each yeah. other, but peas. I don't feel like it turned into like a food fight. Were it they doing like, it in a playful manner? Hmm? Was it being they doing it in a playful like a, manner? Like a bullying manner. I don't know. I just remember like there was a, a big fight. deal Did about they do peas like- being everywhere, but I didn't eat like school lunches then. I was packing my lunch, so I didn't have any peas, so oh. it was probably a bullying manner. I you should do the bursting boba with a with a straw and do. <laughs> it's like a paintball gun. Didn't have like an automatic boba, paintball gun. Let alone have boba in elementary school back in like fifth grade. It's really. I don't even think boba existed. We had, remember, At least I didn't know about it. It did. <laughs> remember when we no had, one here had it. bursting boba? Yeah. For the the Mandalorian. Mm-hmm. And I took a mouthful of boba and I shot it back into the shower back there. Yeah, I think that counts. Yeah. No, it doesn't. It's playful. It's not a fight. It's food. You're not fighting anyone. Fighting food fight. Have ghost. you ever picked up some mashed potatoes and threw them at no. a person? No, I'm trying to like you sh- a, a airborne so pork. When we were kids, out. we used to pick up bales of hay and like do like American gladiators and stuff. I and, mean like, horse food. I'm just saying, like, <laughs> can I count? It, that's some. No, that's the cow's food. No, you it's can't. food. No, we were fighting in no. a playful manner. I think it counts. No. Who are you to be the arbiter of what is true or not? What was your definition of a food fight? I it is exactly. Well, I'm not trying to sign in. <laughs> you have a playful fight in which people throw food at each other. There's nothing in this definition saying it has to be food they're eating. There's nothing in this definition saying that it has to be fucking people food. People food. All right. Yeah. So. Yeah. Go ahead. If we just had sawdust and fucking boards and just were throwing and hitting each other with it, that's yeah. a food fight. Because termites, termites eat fucking sawdust? wood. Is that what you're saying? Uh, yeah. Yeah. See, I would say that I think I can caveat in that the like we would fight in the hayloft, and the hayloft is hay that is meant specifically for food for an animal, whereas sawdust isn't necessarily specifically food for an animal, unless if we were at some type of like termite farm. And we were getting into the sawdust that would later yeah, be food. Yeah, that was intended for food. Yeah. Now, I mean, cows will eat hay, but not all hay is for f- cow, cow food. All the hay in the barn is for cow food. Mm-hmm. What barn? Just in, the in, barn that you're talking about. At the in moment. the hay mount. Mm, I've done this many barns. <laughs> Every barn we have, I've done this. I'm just saying, like, I've seen tons of hay that's yeah. not meant to be eaten by cows. It's hay for people to use for hay. That's what I was saying. Well, generally, that's you strong. use... Yeah. That That's hay? true. Sean Hay. It's different. It's different. It's like the same thing. It's no, it's, it's just not. grown grass that looks weird. And he's showing his yeah. ignorance. Ignorance? Yeah. One's life. I think you're showing ignorance by saying a food fight is you just throwing hay at each other. But it's intended for food. It's not. It's hay for cows or for warm food. Why are we giving whatever. it to the cows? <laughs> what? Why are we giving it to the cows? For warmth. For food. For, for babies. For silage. For in. ruffiage. No, they... I think it counts. I'm, I'm just saying. I think this is also a great episode. Do animals eat people? Yeah. Sometimes. So if I just punch you, is that a food fight? No, you have to throw him at yeah, me. Yeah, you have to throw me at someone in a playful manner. Yeah, like. <laughs> yeah, it's playful. Yeah. We were playing American Gladiators, who often fight each other. So with things. Like, so you could have just said you've never been in a food fight. No, I could. S- I could define myself into it, and I did so successfully. I don't. I don't agree. I don't think you did. I think we'll have. Are a you poll. trying to invalidate his poll. experience? I'm yeah. not invalidating the experience. I'm he invalidating says, that it is, is a food that's, fight. That's, it's a food fight. Yeah. I don't think that that classifies. Yep. What we saw here was a food fight. And Down in the comments. I've never been in one. Yeah. Was a hey, well, American then you wouldn't gladiator know what a food fight is, would farm you? fight, in fact, a food fight, let us know. 
I feel like if the roles were reversed, you'd be like, Aaron, you're an idiot. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't talk about the episode yeah. much. Oh, we hate those kids. I thought it was crazy they kicked out Pierce. Yeah. I'm like, they have to fix it, right? There's no way we go through the first season and we remove a person. I, I didn't figure. Yeah. But I was... They kicked the, out Jack Black. Well, sure, but he wasn't in there initially. <laughs> you know? mm-hmm. But I was like thinking about as, as bad as Pierce is sometimes, some of the things he says, in like a very... I it's a very a twisted, bleak way. I don't yeah. know. He didn't look at her any different than Abed or Troy or anyone else, I suppose. Or maybe he did. I don't know. I was just trying to think about that. Like, it, does he respect her? Does he look at her any differently? Because they brought up like black and woman and different things. Unless the reason he did do it was because she was a woman. In which case, now it's worse. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know either. Like, I want to say. No, I don't like because I bet I feel like whenever they want to bring the, the the story home, they'll make him a sympathetic character. But he's so unsympathetic. I know all the time that like I I, I think you're trying to cheat. Sure, I don't know. Well, I just like shouldn't Abed be in like equal trouble doing it to Troy? Mm. Yeah, like he wanted it to be done to him. That's why he was wearing the underwear. Yeah, but him doing it to Troy, I feel like Abed should be in just as much trouble as Pierce was for doing it to Troy. Mm. In a, in, a, in that kind of sense. But it kind of just turned into like, oh, ha, ha, ha. But then it happened to Shirley, yeah. and then it was like, oh, no. Like, what he considers acceptable gone. is unacceptable. <laughs> yeah. Sure. But he also, I mean, you are right in the sense that he, he did kind of see her in a way the others didn't. And maybe it's a better way. I don't know. It's one of those things where it's like, when trying to think about, like, equality and stuff, too. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Of, like, people who are disabled. Yeah. And, like, well, you're not supposed to treat them differently. But obviously, there's things they can't do, in which yeah. case you have to treat them a little differently, you know? Yeah. So it's like that line of, like, where's the line of, like, treating them like an equal, but also helping someone who's handicapped? You know what I mean? Sure. So, I don't know. It's, it's kind of like in, in that kind of vein, well, where it's like, well, because she's a woman, you shouldn't do this stuff. But also, think, in an equal sense, he did it to Troy. Abed did it to Troy, and no one really was that upset about that. But then it happened to Shirley, and then they were more upset. So it's like, hmm. was it equal? Is it not equal? Where's the line? I don't think Troy wanted either, but Abed was okay to have it happen. But then you get back to Abed know, for revenge. Like, they know Abed and Troy... Have a closer relationship. Are, well, they're also probably a little more secure in that regard, too, whereas Shirley's not very secure there. Sure. It's like a subtle social cue that, that he should be able to read, but he doesn't. Sure. Now, I'm not saying Pierce is right, because Pierce does so many things that I yeah. do not agree with, and I'm like, one, I feel cringy with it, and two, I feel like... I shouldn't laugh at it. Yeah. But I also feel like, what else am I supposed to do? I'm supposed to laugh at this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I don't More know of an uncomfortable it. laugh. Yeah. Like, I really don't know what to do here. <laughs> I just want to be Speaking gone. Of not knowing the right thing to do. Like, my initial feeling is when, when, you know, these kids were treating them like that was upping the physical confrontation. Right? Like... Okay, I'm gonna... You guys just piss me off, I'm gonna do something. And I, I feel like, like that's more acceptable... Than weaponizing sex. Oh, I, was, I feel like I upped the physical conversation. No, yeah, you did. Far. <laughs> like one, I feel like is on the table, but maybe shouldn't because I won't be charged with assault and go to jail. You know. Yeah. But the other one, I feel like you're you're weaponizing sex, which is just weird to me. So one, I'm like, well, yeah, we'll definitely do this. We won't do this. Am I wrong in that? To weaponize. Should sex? I see them as equally? Is wrong? Weaponizing sex bad? I think so. But can it not be like a, like is it like a, can you reward with it? Is that equally weaponizing it? It's like, hey, finish the dishes. Mm-hmm. Kind of thing. Yeah, but it's not a weapon. It's a. Is that not using it for like a different kind of like leaving chests you, of gold out on the battlefield is not the same someone. as leaving mines. Like I understand, like <laughs> these <laughs> like, it's like, not like, these teenagers <laughs> mocking me have they, they okay now we've went into this area of like a confrontation, and I feel like the other like the banging his mom thing is using sex or trying to have sex with someone to sure. hurt someone sure which feels like well that's just a shitty thing to do no, I'm way yeah, better I morally just like punching this kid if I punch him he's never gonna do this again at least not to me so is it well I'm not one to start out is it more I know. Yeah. is it more moral to punch a kid yeah or to and I would say event, like his goal was to consensually have sex yes. with yeah. the kid's mom, yes. but in the vein of, I'm going to hurt, hurt this, this kid. kid. Yeah. Which one's more morally correct? Yeah. And I don't think I would like necessarily naturally go right to punching. Sure. But it might end up there if this yeah. kid's so schmitty and so... <laughs> you it's know? kind of yeah, the vein I of like... I can't believe you used that as a real word. Yeah. It's, it's kind of like the idea of like... Don't punch me. 
I, I, I'm pissed off at my husband. Yeah. And he's like, you suck. Oh, yeah, well, I fucked your brother. Yeah. And it's like... Jesus. You know what I mean? Yeah. I've heard, like, stories or shows or whatever that I've done, uh-huh. that kind of shit, where it's like, I banged your brother to get back at him. But... Yeah, that's I, crazy. I, that one seems a little bit more... Yeah. But I imagine that was... I try to think, thing, like, what is it about me that lets me go so easily down this path, but won't at all down this one? Sure. Like, is it some type of religious upbringing? Is it the way I was... Punish as a child, <laughs> you know. There's so many reasons. I don't know which way is like yeah. the more morally correct answer. Because like yeah, one is like uh, I wouldn't, I, but I wouldn't so easily punch the girl that was with their group. I'd probably like throw her shirt really far. She had to go get it. <laughs> Take her backpack yeah. off and throw it into a pond. Throw it into the woods. Yeah, <laughs> right into the woods. So you're this. more likely to punch the boy yeah. than to bang his mom. Yeah. Are you more likely to punch the girl than to bang her mom? Yeah. Definitely. You would punch 100%. her before then. Okay. Yeah. I'd rock. Yeah. That girl's face would be rocked <laughs> before I go there, is what I mean. Ne- neither. The <laughs> wording tone that down wasn't great. Great. What? I'm just saying. Your excitement and speed to respond. <laughs> she put herself in this stadium of pain. <laughs> <laughs> she didn't know it was a stadium of pain. She does now. You know what? She'll never do it again. At least not to me. That's not solving any it's issues. So. It's and besides issue. which, I feel like these kids yeah. are the same era of kid yeah. of like. Remember that one clip on Scared Straight where they had that kid, like, yeah. pressed up against the, the crack of uh-huh. the door where that, like, rapist inmate was? Yeah. And he was like, you want to go in there? I'll push you in there. He's like, I can't. Why not? Because you haven't opened a door. Yeah, I remember that. It's like, the total stupid fearlessness mm-hmm. of these kids probably would not be intimidated by physical violence. Maybe. But they would by banging But I feel mom. like... Is that you're saying? Oh, maybe. maybe, because that's ponage. It's more psychological. Yeah. Than it is, like, physical harm. And... Through the winning That's of their the fight, phone. they actually got the mom to turn on the kid. It's like, no, I'm I guess not. So, what is know. the etymology of ponage? Uh, own and own. Uh, pummel. Uh, What's look like it up? pawn? I think we're gonna be looking at it. Pawn stars? No, pawn what is like noob, is like gamer, to... right? And then pawn is like to own a noob something. gamer, something That's like that. That's pawning. I don't want a pawn broker. P W N. What is it to pawn someone? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, pawn is a lot like the sense of own. That means to have power and mastery over someone. It has also been used to describe the act of gaining illegal access to something. You may have heard kids saying it when they're playing video games with their friends. <laughs> I totally pawned you, man. Oh man, I got pawned. It's unbelievable. You should have said a typo it. from the word own because O and P are close to each other on the keyboard. Hmm. When they say, I own you. Oh. I pwned you. It's just people being dumb. It's just a typo. It's like when people do a, what's... Leet speak or... Well, it wasn't the being like T-E-H, like a oh, common thing. Uh, yeah, yeah, for a long time. And like, it's like a common typo, but Bay. it turns into being like, now it's a word for some reason. Not just, you fucked up. B-A-U was like... Someone was like, ah, I'll mock you because you fucked up your typing. Like, no, I meant you that. You've been pwned. That's the new word. Like, who started that? Who did that? Someone much younger You know how whenever you have like a, like, here's my side of the discussion, and then you mistype stuff, people are like, oh, you idiot, you can't even type right. Hmm. Who was like, you know what, I did type right. You got, you didn't just get owned, you got pwned. Who did that? I don't know. Some genius little fucking kid. Interesting. Who did deserve to have his mom banged. So it's based on <laughs> genius little kid. It's based off of... I don't know. So he <laughs> has credit for being a genius, but also negative credit for being that same genius. Yeah. Yes. In order to have his mother banged. It's amazing how yeah. fluid Why is it by who? It could be by that. By that, so I don't know. Do what? It's amazing how fluid language is. Yeah, it changes a lot, yeah. right? Mm. This show is taking us on a lot of... No, I just, I'm just thinking about, like, I get, like, a lot of DMs from, like, homosexual guys. Apparently, they, they're really into, like, big, hairy people. And, like, you they're, know, they're always talking yeah. about how they want to duck. And I'm like, oh, I think I know what that means now. Just yeah. Like, yeah, okay. It's so that it can pass through, like, mm-hmm. profanity filters and yeah. stuff. Gotcha. It, they want, yeah. like, to go like this. Yeah. Man, you're turning so many people on right now. More penguin. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this reaction to Community. Check out the next four episodes right now over at patreon.com slash blindwave, where we also have full length where you can watch along with us. We're watching off Netflix, so check that out.